Hey, good morning, Los Angeles. Welcome to my new humble abode in Koreatown, LA. Check this out. Yeah. So this is my new room and my new apartment in my brand new home in a brand new city. For those of you who don't know, I've completed my education both in liberal arts and mixology. So naturally the next step is to move to a big city and a <laughs> Why? This is already too hard. I'm coming home. So things are going well. I'm not a child star, nor am I the heir to any kind of fortune. Still holding out for a Princess Diaries style life change, but uh, until then, I have to find a job. After I finish my coffee, I'm gonna get up, get dressed, and get in my car and try and make people like me enough to pay me to hang out with them and do everything that they don't feel like doing. The glamorous lifestyle of an entertainment industry assistant. So here's a fun interview look. The polka dots say, like, I work hard, but when's happy hour, you know what I mean? I don't know. What do you think? Sometimes I just wonder if I'm in over my head, you know? So what do you think? Can you envision me putting you through to your agent? One of the most fun things about Los Angeles is you get to practice your driving. Malcolm Gladwell suggests 10,000 hours to become an expert at something. So with the standard LA commute, it only takes about 10 days to get really good at sitting in traffic. But it's a beautiful look. Wow, this is not safe. Here we go, interview time. So I think it went well. I accidentally said supposedly, so we'll see what happens. I got the job! The pants worked! Woo! <sighs> so I will be working at the Paul Connor Agency, which is the second oldest talent agency in Hollywood, and I'm gonna be an assistant. Did you hear I'm employed? I got the job! <sighs> I am so excited. I can't believe it. What is happening? So tomorrow I am going to the DMV to get my license and registration. Stay tuned. <laughs>